the mere mention of the name Anguilla brings up images in our minds of beautiful sandy beaches. Brad and Jen walking on those sandy beaches, as well as luxury exotic resorts. Five star. But what if I told you that Anguilla has a more affordable side to it? Well, that's what we're talking about today. <music> Absolutely, Anguilla is all about luxury, beautiful beaches, gorgeous people, and a certain tranquility wrapped in blue. Hi, my name is Rizal, the traveling island girl on social media. Welcome back to my channel. This is where you got to be for everything Caribbean. If you are new here, please subscribe, hit that like button as well as that share button. And why don't you just ring on that bell just to get notified whenever I post a new video. You won't regret it. Anyways, in this video, like promised, we're talking about a more affordable side to Anguilla. And I recently traveled there just to explore and do some research on your behalf. Yes, you're welcome. And one of those accommodations that I stayed at, one of four, was this beautiful, very quaint, very charming, comfortable, and perfectly located next to gorgeous beaches as well as great restaurants in the west end of the island. This is Hummingbird. Hummingbird Airbnb and I'm also the publisher of True Anguilla magazine. Um, so I opened Hummingbird about two years ago, just over two years ago and um, it was really, I just spotted an opportunity with a, a spare room in my house which I was able to um, turn into its own sort of private space and um, I was doing it for about six seven months before the pandemic came along and it was immediately very successful and busy. I think it's um, hit a niche in the market. It's um, very affordable, uh, but it's also in a very uh, sought after destination. So I'm right in the heart of the West End and you can walk to a number of beaches and to a lot of the main luxury properties. Um, so it's just a kind of great value in a great spot in Anguilla. I, I love the interior that I've chosen, the high ceilings, the white wood, it's very light and airy. But I guess my favourite thing is the garden and that's what I've put quite a lot of work into. And I'm really proud of the new um, indoor-outdoor kitchen lounge. It's kind of a very cool place to sit and you've got total privacy and it's very relaxing. Uh, what makes Anguilla so special is the incredible beaches, which everyone has, and then the really friendly people, which everyone also says they have. But it's true here. Every beach is kind of your own, really. There's nowhere, nowhere's crowded, and there's nothing kind of cookie cutter about Anguilla. Everything is unique and um, very, very much of the place. I think the things that one of two things that make Hummingbird very unique are the gardens all around and then um, the ability to 
spend time with my four pets. I have four rescue animals, two cats, Mr. Mew and Funny Face, and two dogs called Foxy and Godiva. And if you come to Hummingbird and you would like to spend time with them, you can. recently published a uh, novelist. Uh, my first book, Ennis Turquoise, came out earlier this year and it's been really well received and I've loved doing it. Um, I've written a second one and that's with my editor at the moment and my plan is to have a kind of little publishing empire of, of books based on the characters that I created and which I really enjoy and these are people that have come to the Caribbean to live and have found it a place that has kind of enhanced their lives and changed their purpose. I leave a copy in the in Hummingbird for the guests to read and I ask them to sign it as well and then if they would um, like their own copy then they can buy one from me and of course I'll give them a personal message. <laughs> Well, that was it for this second episode in my video series about affordable Anguilla. I hope to tune in again next week when I when we delve a little bit more into what all there is to do on the island right now. That's it for me. I'm bidding you adieu. My name is Rizal, the Traveling Island Girl. Until next